in this video I'm going to show you a few abandoned homeless camps like this one right here. You can see the telltale signs of the pathway. I walked on the pathway for a little bit to come across the old encampment. It's been long since abandoned, but you can see where someone had set up. The ground is nice and worn, and it looks comfortable out of the rain. And here's the remnants of an old cooking pit. Really bad spot for it next to the trees, but yeah. It's a good spot in the uh, fact that there's multiple ways to get in and out just in case you have to book it in a hurry. Uh, yeah, no, I found three entrances and exits. Well, the path now is covered in leaves. It's well worn and used a lot, so I would guess someone stayed here for a few months. I'll just take you on a quick walk through until I get out. While well, walking through the area, I found another well-worn path. I'm going down that now as we speak. You might not be able to see it, but I can. There seems to always be telltale signs of someone going and coming, like right here. It's very obvious after you get past the first few steps. When I got past this area, I stumbled upon an active camp. There was someone inside. I asked if I could take a few shots. He said yes, so here they are. It's very well hidden. This is an actual shot of the outside. I wish I could have got the dweller inside to speak to me, but I understand wanting privacy. And truthfully, just walking in the area, just walk through the forests, You'd be surprised if you just open your eyes how many people you'll stumble on who are just trying to make it by and live. This is just a spot where someone tied up for a couple nights, didn't stay long, but you can tell someone was here for a bit. Not a great spot, it's very wet and buggy. A very terrible spot to stay. I understand why no one's here anymore. On to the next camp. I wasn't there long. There was someone home. It was very well set up. I didn't intrude. He said I could take a couple shots. The guy's even got power and solar. It's amazing. This is not so much a camp, but rather where I spent my first few nights. Kind of like an under bridge statue kind of deal. Finding an actual place to camp is really hard. This is a horrible choice but it was a place to lay my head for a couple nights to stay out of the rain. There's paths coming to it, paths leading out. People stumble on you, you're right in the open, and it was a very poor choice. This is uh, right at where I'm currently camped out. Notice you can't see it at all. The path getting into it is very well hidden. You can see my trail that I've made, but to find it, it's hard. Uh, it's a really decent spot way out of the way. I used a few things to, you know, block the trail off that I've made, make it a little bit more difficult to get in, and just to know if someone has been there in my absence. But even then, you're right now dead close. You can't see my camp. 